What's going on there, YouTube? Vaping with Twisted 420 has returned. Now today, people, this video is weird, okay? It's kind of peculiar, and I gotta give you some backstory behind it, okay? Some of you might have seen the uh, Dallas Cowboys game day vlog, and you saw that we got to go to a beef jerky outlet in Arlington. I didn't know there were such things as beef jerky outlets. Now let me tell you, people, I've had all kinds of jerky. I'm a bit of a jerky connoisseur. And I'm not just talking about like Jack Links and Slim Jims and shit. I'm talking about some homemade Texas stuff. I've had some, the wildest thing I've had is some deer jerky and it was fucking amazing. But anyway, at this uh, jerky outlet, they had all kinds of crazy stuff. Like you could just get some crocodile meat if you want, all kinds of crazy stuff. So I had to pick up some things, okay? I had to pick up some things. I ended up picking up. Now one of them I got is just a regular jerky, but it's really good. It's a sweet barbecue, three beer barbecue rub. Been eating it pretty good, pretty good. That's just regular jerky, right? But this other stuff, this other stuff is mighty peculiar. I got some freaking duck. It's all mixed with pork too, by the way. All this is gonna be mixed with pork. We got maple flavored duck with pork, mallard duck, which is very peculiar for me because I'm a mallard. And growing up, everything in our house was mallard. Soap dispensers, a phone with the eyes that lit up that was a mallard duck, so this is weird. And they had a mallard duck hanging up in the jerky place stuffed on the wall. I felt bad looking at it. I'm gonna feel bad eating it. But anyway, we got uh, some duck and pork. We got ostrich. We got kangaroo, and we got alligator. <laughs> All very strange stuff. And what I'm gonna do here is taste it and tell you guys what I think. I think I'm a bit of a professional when it comes to jerky. So we're gonna see what happens. All right, we're gonna start with the duck. Let's see what we got here. Let's see. The duck. Real tangy. I get the maple. It's a real gamey flavor. It's real, real soft to chew into. It's weird. You get like a tang, almost sour taste with it when you bite into this weird mix. It's like one of those flavored Slim Jims, but this is all. It's pretty good. It's almost got a pickled taste to it, the meat. That's weird. That's weird. Uh, I'm done with that one. That was, that was, it's kind of a weird taste. You don't expect like sour, weird shit, tangy stuff going on with your meat, but that definitely had it. Let's do, not bad though. I taste pretty good. <laughs> Us mallards taste pretty good. Let's go for alligator. And I know this stuff's supposed to be real tough. And the shit they had hanging up in there for the meat, it looked really tough. What, see, what flavor is this? Cause it, okay, it's all barbecue. I think it's all barbecue, yeah. Uh, alligator. I've never eaten alligator by itself. I know a lot of people have. We're real close to Louisiana. People are into that shit over there. I don't even like the look of it. Let me show you this, what that looks like. It's got a weird, it's got a weird look to it, weird texture, but we're gonna see what happens. All right, here goes some alligator. Real chewy. Real chewy. It tastes like what I expect the alligator feels like. <laughs> kind of like scaly and rough. Seems like it'd be real chewy. Came from some swamp down in fucking Louisiana. Just living this life and one day somebody fucking shot it. Pulled it up on the boat and put it on reality TV. And now I'm eating it. Oh, ah. It's weird, man. It's like the texture of the chew. You just, just got to keep chewing. It's like it breaks down into multiple pieces every time you take a bite. It's like fucking Agent Smith on the Matrix. Just multiplying. Very chewy. Weird. It's got a weird little uh to it that I can't explain. I'm going to say I'm not really, I'm just really not a fan of that. I'm not a fan of that. All right, then, am I? Now we're gonna take a trip down on the head yeah? with the fucking kangaroo meat. Ah, kangaroo meat. All right, let's see what we got here. Oh, fuck, I tore it wrong. This is kangaroo, that, all right? All right, I'm gonna, gonna go ahead and open up the kangaroo, that, hey, you fucking cunt, eh? Yeah? They like to say cunt a lot in Australia. 
I have no problem with it. It's a, a lot of people don't like the word. I don't have a problem with it. All right, fucking kangaroo. They're real cute too, man. You know, they, you see them boxing and shit. They seem like really cool animals. Here we go, fucking kangaroo. They eat it over there too in Australia, so fuck it. Kind of tastes like the outback. You know, a lot of uh, a lot of deserts, a lot of hills and plains. <sighs> Aborigines and stuff. I don't know about that. It kind of reminds me of regular jerky, peppered, kind of a peppered jerky, kind of a peppered flavor. And this was what? This was just original, so. Got kind of a smoky taste to it. Mm, it's weird. Let me get one more bite of this kangaroo. On all of these, being that I only usually eat beef and pork, sometimes chicken, you can tell they're definitely not the animals that you eat normally when you're chewing on it. Mm. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about kangaroo. It really wasn't that bad. I mean, if I was stuck out in the outback, out in the brush, and um, I had to kill a kangaroo and eat it, it doesn't seem like it would be that bad. That wasn't bad. That wasn't bad at all. And last but not least, ostrich. Fucking ostrich. This ought to be interesting. This is ostrich. Let's just get a look at that. This is ostrich meat. And they got like, and this came with multiple strips. It was in a bigger package too. Well, let's see what ostrich is all about. Oh, right away. Right away, you can tell this ain't no chicken. Oh, very gamey. Oh, ostrich is, and it could be because it's fucking rotten meat, but, oh, oh. Ostrich is the worst. Don't eat ostrich, people. I think there's, you shouldn't eat ostrich is what you're selling. That's nature's way of telling you don't eat ostrich. I don't like the taste to it. it it's not, not a good taste. Now, just to get oh, get that ostrich out of my mouth, I'm going to go back with the uh, three beer rub, sweet barbecue. This shit's good. This is some good shit. Just regular jerky. You know, I think that's something I learned today after eating all these jerkies. It's best just to eat regular jerky. Look at that. Just good old, good old fashioned jerky right there. That's what that is. A little chewy, you yeah. know? That's what jerky's supposed to taste like. And deer jerky is really good. So I guess, like, cows and deer are really the only thing you need to be making jerky out of. Because those other animals were not very appealing. Okay? Oh. Anyway. Oh. This is so good. So good. Real chewy, though. Anyway, folks. I hope you enjoyed me eating these um, exotic meats. <laughs> Fucking uh, had no idea. Ooh, ostrich was the worst. I'd say out of all the weird ones, I think I like the, I don't know, I think I like the kangaroo the most. I really do. The kangaroo, I think, had the best taste to me. Everything else was a little, eh, a little weird, you know what I mean? But yeah, folks, that's what, that's, man, fucking jerky video. Strange jerky. That's what it's all about. Uh, really, that's what I got for you, folks. Y'all uh, stay sexy out there.